All right, trainers. So, by the time you're watching this video, I listen. The guarantee of raids has already long gone, been over, uh, because it actually started today. As a matter of fact, in a couple of minutes, actually. Um, so I hope you you get your shiny Garantina. Hopefully, I get mine. I won't be able to participate, but you know I'll get mine some way, shape, or form. But with that being said, just know you know these videos are going to be coming out a little later because I work two jobs now, so it's going to take a little time for me to get these videos out uh, to you all. And I hope you still rock with my video. If you rock with me, you rock with my videos. Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and uh, yeah. And uh, so all you can just watch my videos for entertainment purposes. But with that also being said, guys. Um, yeah, so like I said, this, this guarantee a raid is going to be long gone before, uh, while you're watching this video. But yeah, and I also know about the newest uh, event that actually starts tomorrow. I'm going to make a video about that hopefully tomorrow, the day after, something like that. But stay tuned for that. Uh, by that time, you guys already know what's going on. But like I said, hopefully you still watch my videos, still rock my videos. You just watch them for entertainment purposes. But anyway, guys, with that said, I have to get ready to leave because uh, I'm leaving now for my job. So with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoy my video and uh yeah let's get into it let's go Alright trainers, what's going on guys? I'm back again with another video, back again with another video, back, back, back again with another video. So when you see this gorgeous and handsome face from a very long time, might I add, you already know that there's more Pokemon Go info. So in today's video, okay, first of all, before I get into today's video, I know it's been a very long time since I've made videos. It's been like, what, three weeks? But guys, I'm back because I have two jobs. Motorcycles. Anyway, so now I'm gonna try to squeeze in time because it's gonna be kind of hard for me to make videos now. But I have two jobs, so whenever I have time, I'll squeeze it in. The videos may be a little late, but hey, it is what it is. I'm trying to make that money. So, without further ado, guys, that was a bus, by the way. That's why I saw that shadow. But anyway, guys, without further ado, we're not gonna jump into this video now, but we're gonna jump into this video right now. Let's go. All right, trainers, so I'm finally back after all this time. I'm back on YouTube. So, now, I'm gonna share some information with all of you. Uh, like I say, in most of my videos, if not all, I know you might have know or heard about this info uh, in Pokemon Go or for Pokemon Go. Um, but for those of you that actually don't know, because I've actually realized that a lot of people um, whether or not I make my video, there's a lot of people who still don't know what's going on half the time. So, and like I had to let people know about uh, Shiny Yama and like a couple days ago because they, they didn't know. So I told them about it. I told them about my channel. And uh, hopefully they're following me on YouTube now. But anyway, for those of you that don't know, which is why I always say that, uh, Altered Form Garantina is returning to raids. Uh, we're going to talk about that, Raid Hour, and the Shiny Release. So, here we go. All right, so it says, Trainers, we are excited to announce that Garantina has reemerged from the distortion world and returned to Raid. Now, a lot of people want the Origin form instead of the Altered form because a lot of people appreciate the Altered form. I'm sorry, the Origin form more than the Altered form. Anyhow, the date and time is from Monday, September 23rd, which is tomorrow uh, at 1 p.m. PDT, which is 4 o'clock here in the Americas, uh, to Thursday, October 17th at 1 p.m. PDT. Now, Garantina in its altered form will be available in five-star raids, so Mewtwo will no longer be in raids anymore. And on September 25th, which is actually in two more days, I wanna say, three more days, 
Cause today's 22nd, second, three, four, four. Yeah, about three, three more days. Well, this day is pretty much over. But anyway, two, three more days from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. in your local time zone. There will be an increased number of five-star raids featuring Alter Form Garantina. Now, we're gonna talk about that, but just because you see that, we're also gonna get the five-star raid makeup day, uh, which is October the 5th or is it October the 8th? Uh, I'm gonna clarify that uh, and when we talk about Mewtwo. So, anyway, uh, starting tomorrow, um, yeah, we're getting all the form Garantina, and uh, it says if you're lucky, you might encounter a shiny all the form Garantina. Uh, so, to so start prepping your team to take on the Ghost and Dragon type legendary Pokemon, so Garantina is in fact coming back, and um, there's still many mysteries to be unraveled about the Renegade Pokemon. Stay safe and happy rating the Pokemon Go team. Now, I want to, before I jump to the next topic, I just want to clarify something. A lot of people will always say, oh, well, you know, they bringing back, you know, old content or old raid bosses and everybody wants Darkrai. Well, here's a little something for you. Darkrai will probably be featured as a tier 5 raid boss or maybe an EX raid boss during Halloween. So, that'll make sense because it's next month. Um, Coffus Grigus is a Gen 5 Pokemon, they might be releasing him for Halloween because it that would actually be the best thing to do because Niantic needs content for a Halloween event like it did with Gengar and everybody else. So, now with that being said, uh, so hopefully you guys can get your, sh your shiny Garantina. Some of you don't care about uh, this event that goes on tomorrow. Um, well, technically it's not an event, but still. You still got the shiny form and a lot of people that's another thing people talk about uh you know shiny pokemon is not new content it might be for some people and it might not be for some people but i want to make another video about that separately because i've been wanting to make a video like that uh letting people know my thoughts on that whole topic but anyway we're gonna get into the next topic um so i'm gonna save that video for another time but like i said let's get into the next topic All right, so it says Mewtwo with Shadow Ball joins EX Raids. Now, a lot of people saying that Sh uh, Shadow Ball Mewtwo was a legacy move on Mewtwo. So, actually, that Pokemon is actually returning. So, if you want your Shadow Ball Mewtwo, now's the time to get it. Don't forget, Mewtwo can also be shiny. So, if you don't have your shiny Mewtwo, now's the time to go after that, such as myself. Also, if you still don't have your shiny Mewtwo, like I said, you still have time because the makeup day is next month on the 5th or the 8th. And again, we're gonna talk about that right after this. So, trainers, the genetic Pokemon Mewtwo will be returned to EX Raids, date and time, starting on September 25th, 29th uh, of this year at 1 p.m. PDT, which is four o'clock. Trainers can receive EX Raid passes to be invited to EX Raids featuring Mewtwo. Now, a lot of people are having hard times with getting EX Raid passes, and if you are getting them, they have a hard time actually uh, using them because they have to work or go to school or something like that so they can't attend. Uh, so the best thing you can do is actually invite someone who can make it. If they can't make it, then that EX Ray Pass actually goes up into smoke and into oblivion until you get a new one and you can actually start back battling. Once you get a new EX Ray Pass and you have time to take down Mewtwo, which is hopefully shiny. Um, yeah, so. The features, challenge Mewtwo with the Shadow Ball attack exclusively in EX Rage. Don't forget Side Strike Mewtwo uh, is actually ending on the, was it tomorrow? Or on the 25th? I think it's ending tomorrow. Anyway, you guys know what I'm saying. So that's Side Strike. A lot of people are talking about how Side Strike is weak and all this kind of stuff. Sometimes it's not all about the moves unless you're actually doing PvP battles. Uh, Side Strike is a really collectibles, uh, you know, um, move set uh, any Pokemon with any move set is, is a collectibles because like or that's probably just me because I just like to catch Pokemon but you know for some people they really like their Pokemon to have a certain kind of move and that's cool but again like I said I'm gonna make a video about that separately because that's gonna go into what I want to mention um yeah so basically challenge Mewtwo with the Shadow Ball attack exclusively in EX Rage if you're lucky you might encounter a shiny Mewtwo are you new to EX Raids? You can become eligible to receive an EX Raid Pass when you win a raid battle at a qualifying gym. Um, so yeah, battling Mewtwo will be a difficult challenge that requires trainers to take advantage of every opportunity, so don't forget. Oh, okay, so it's just basically letting you know what you gotta do. We already know about that. So I don't even have to talk about that. So, 
with that being said guys so that's shadow ball uh mewtwo which is coming to ex raids and it's taken over from deoxys which now you should have all your deoxys because during the event before as far as own event uh deoxys was actually in um all of deoxys uh from speed form attack form defense form all that was in the tier 5 raids uh, a couple weeks ago for the uh was it the bonus unlock tier two not tier two but like challenge two or oh, how, however you're saying it but part two that's all for but yeah so hopefully you have all your deoxys your shiny mewtwo's and everything like that because it's going to start getting cool uh with the new events that nitic is actually setting out and uh yeah so now with that being said let's jump into another part of this video All right, so now we're on Niantic support. Niantic's actual official Twitter page it says trainers to make up legendary raid hour featuring Mewtwo with the uh, with the move side strike will be on October eighth. So it's not in fact uh, October fifth. It's actually in fact October the eighth uh, from six p.m. to seven p.m. local time. Stay tuned for details. So some people think it's lame. Some people that's that's why I said like I'm not gonna show you everybody's tweet, but the first tweet says it's lame. Like that's just how they feel, you know. But Everybody plays the game differently. Everybody's looking for different things, but you gotta understand that Niantic can't please everyone. And like I said, I'm just gonna give you a snippet of my thoughts on this whole Niantic and Pokemon Go thing. You know, that's just, that's a snippet that I'm gonna give you right there. But like I said, I wanna make another video for a different time so I can go all in and let you guys know uh, about, I mean, I'm sure you guys already know, but I really wanna like get this out to you guys. Uh, that's probably gonna be in the next video or whatever. But, with that being said, now let's jump into the next topic. All right, now we're gonna talk about Ditto and what it's hiding in uh, within the Gen 5 uh, Pokemon. Ditto has new hiding disguises. So that's the update for Ditto here in Pokemon Go. Uh, now I'm reading off of future game releases. A lot of people say that's not a reliable source, but and it is indeed. A reliable source maybe not to some people but to others it actually is including myself now with that being said because you normally whenever future releases uh future game releases actually mention something you you usually find it uh in other um reliable sites such as when trails was talking about the universe stone well i know about the universe stone which is why i made that video if you had not watched it go back and, and check that out and i got it off of future game releases and other sites or I'll just read it right from Trails. So, either way, it's a reliable source and or website. So, the update, Pokemon Go, which uh, Pokemon can be Ditto in disguise. So, a lot of people are still trying to find Ditto so they can, um, I guess, do their Jirachi or uh, whatever uh, research from a while ago. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to get into that right now. So we're going to start with Gen 1 first. All right, so it says the normal type Gen 1 Pokemon Ditto is not like any other Pokemon. Ditto can take the form of other Pokemon and can be a big pain in the butt to find, especially when it comes down to completing quests in Pokemon Go and you might end up getting stuck on that specific quest. So learning which Pokemon can be Ditto in the wild could be helpful. All right, now a lot of players are struggling to find Ditto in the wild and don't know which Pokemon can be a Ditto in disguise. For that reason, I've decided to dig a little bit deeper and find the right answer. So, current Ditto disguise is now in Gen 1. It's Venonat, Paris, and introducing Weedle. So now, Ditto is hiding as Weedle now in Gen 1. So, Venonat and Paris is was, is already a thing, but, Par uh, but Weedle is actually one of the new ones. Now we're going to go into Gen 2. Alright, so Gen 2, Hoot Hoot, we already know, Lediba. That's one of the new ones, I believe. Remoraid, and people are saying Spinarak, but they're still investigating that. Some people are saying that they caught it as a Spinarak. Now, I saw video footage of someone actually catching it as a Hoppet, so I think that's probably confirmed. Uh, it just hasn't been mentioned, though, but it is, it's is—it's not confirmed, confirmed, but I saw it in my own uh, two eyes, but you know how some people can still alter a video, but I doubt they altered this because just the way it is. But anyway, so, uh, Spinarak. So, like, that's, like I said, they're still inve investigating that. Uh, by the way, this video may not be up tonight. It'll be probably be up tomorrow. But, uh, yeah, it's just still cool to watch. So, if you're still rocking with my video, even though my videos are going to be a little late, 
you know that's that that's cool that's real decent of, of you so anyway let's get into gen 3 so now uh wismer uh ditto could be hiding ass i think that's one of the new ones i'm not sure no it's not it's one of the old ones gulpin and skitty is is a new one numal is a new one and c dot is a new one so those three are new uh pokemon that ditto could be hiding under so if you're looking for ditto those are the pokemon that you want to be catching especially wismer and if you're speaking of wismer if you're still trying to get your your, your jirachi and you happen to see a wismer because you do need that wismer uh in the research in order to obtain jirachi just hope it's not a ditto but either way if it is a ditto and you need ditto you still probably need that from you so either way you're in luck both times so if you don't need it un unless you don't need it then it's not gonna really suck that bad um so yeah let's get into gen 4 all right so gen 4 is bidoof so if you want ditto capture bidoof gen 5 is p dove but like they say uh they're not sure yet but reports are coming in that some players caught ditto disguised as a p dove so if you're looking for ditto you i mean you can still search on, on your own spinnerack p dove and hop it uh to see if it's confirmed for you well not confirmed for you because it'll be just nobody mentioned it yet but a lot of times things in pokemon go aren't announced and you just got to find it on your own so i mean it's not a big deal um so yeah if that's what you're looking for if you're looking for ditto for whatever reason or if you just want a ditto uh then yeah i suggest you try that you know uh so yeah p dub spin hop it those guys see if they work out for you as a ditto all right so we're gonna get into one more topic before i wrap this video up all right, so basically, hopefully, all of you um, have enjoyed the Alright, so basically that special Pokemon for next month's upcoming community day is Trap Pinch. The sand I think it's the, the sand pinch Pokemon or the, the I don't know the, the pincher Pokemon or something like that. But anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh so yeah, this is next month. This is what a lot of people have been waiting for. The shiny uh trap pinch. I'm gonna show you up on screen before I end this video. Uh so you can see what the shiny forms look like. Uh, so yeah, with that, I, I made another video, but I'm just gonna make this one giant video in this video, so I'm not gonna probably put that one up. But anyway, I'm gonna show you what shiny trap pinch for Bravo and Flygon looks like if you don't already. Even if you do, I'm gonna still put it up. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna scroll down here. The feature Pokemon, obviously, like I said, is trap pinch. Exclusive move, obviously, they're gonna tell us once it comes closer to the time of next month. And bonus, you get three catch XP, which is nothing new. It's normally two times catch. Um, and then bonus is three hour lures, so that's nothing new. Um, the event starts October the 12th, uh, next month, from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. And I'm starting to like that night they're doing this morning uh, community day because, like, it really gets you out there during the morning instead of, like, in the afternoon. 
Because I guess Niantic you know, figures that everybody complains about going to school and all that, but in the morning time, it's not really school time because it's the weekend. So they want to get you up as early as possible so you can go about your day when the event ends uh, at 2 o'clock. But um, yeah, so that's going to basically wrap this video up now. So if you like this video, short video, because it's probably like 20 minutes. Yeah, it's almost 20 minutes long. Uh, so yeah, so make sure you guys, if you like this video, make sure you guys like, comment, sub. Share this video with you share cool stuff. Comment down below. Smack a like on this video. Turn post notifications on so you can stay updated on my latest videos. Make sure you crush the notification bell so you'll be the first to get my videos when I upload to YouTube. And uh, as always, guys, peace and love. Stay humble. Keep your head up. And remember to always, always stay blessed. And I'm out. Peace.